Thank you for joining. I hope that you are doing well. Common food combinations that may cause digestive problems. Food combining is a health conscious approach to eating, where foods that require different digestive environments are eaten separately. If the food you eat is not digesting properly, not only can painful gas, heartburn, acid reflux, and other stomach problems arise, but your body will also be deprived of critical nutrients. I will be providing you with a few food combinations that are considered bad by Ayurveda, modern hygienists, and physiologists. Most people feel a surge of energy and naturally lose weight once they start following several simple food combining rules. Lasagna or grilled cheese sandwich. Protein starch combos inhibit salivary digestion of starch. Protein and starches need different enzymes and different levels of acidity to be digested. When eaten together, your body is forced to make a choice to digest protein but not starches. The undigested starchy food then undergoes fermentation and decomposition and over time leads to poisonous end products. Supposedly adding greens to hard to digest cheesy dishes makes them easier for the stomach. Cheese and meat omelet. In general, protein slash protein combinations are not recommended. One single concentrated protein per meal is easier to digest and won't require as much energy. Go for a veggie omelet instead. Tomato and cheese pasta sauce. Tomatoes are considered acidic and are not advised to be mixed with starchy carbohydrates, such as pasta. Food combining theory recommends to avoid mixing carbohydrates with acids. Adding dairy to this already difficult combo turns it into a recipe for digestive problems. And after meal fatigue, since your body will require a ton of energy to digest this meal, have pasta with pesto and grilled veggies instead. Eating fruit after a meal. Natural hygienists have known for a long time that fruit doesn't combine well with other foods. The reason is that fruit contains simple sugars that require no digestion. I have a whole video covering this. I will post a link in the description. Beans and cheese. Dairy protein and beans is a common combo in any Mexican restaurant, eaten with a hearty serving of guacamole and hot sauce. It is almost guaranteed to lead to gas and bloating. It is not the beans on their own that cause it, but the combination as a whole. Try skipping cheese and tomatoes if you have a weak digestion or working on detoxifying your body. Banana and milk. Ayurveda lists this combination as one of the heaviest and toxin forming. It is said to create heaviness in the body and slow down the mind. If you are a fan of milk-based banana smoothies, make sure that the banana is very ripe and add cardamom and nutmeg to stimulate digestion. Lemon dressing on cucumber and tomato salad. Nightshades, such as potatoes, chilies, eggplant, and tomatoes, are not supposed to be combined with cucumbers, while lemon does not go well with either. Of course, everyone has a different body and will experience various levels of sensitivity to bad food combinations. Many people attribute digestive problems and allergies to particular foods, while in reality, it is the combination of the foods to blame. Also, many of us are used to digestive discomforts that we don't know what it feels like not to experience it. Everything becomes clear in comparison. If you follow simple food combination rules for two weeks and let your digestive system rest, your digestion will be a lot more efficient and stronger. Cravings will subside, there will be more energy and a flatter belly. Please stay tuned. I will be sharing a video soon on proper food combinations. Thank you for watching. Good day and good health.